Hey everyone, welcome to the Heroic Realms channel, my name is Brandon. In today's video I wanted to talk about Iron Man Superior, and who is he and will we see him in future movies? It might be obvious who Iron Man Superior is, I am Iron Man. but for some people they may not know. Iron Man Superior is Tony Stark. In the comics Avengers and X-Men Access, the Avengers find themselves fighting an embodied Red Skull known as Red Skull Onslaught. Red Skull was able to possess the now deceased Professor Xavier's brain, which gives Red Skull Onslaught immersed psychic powers and his innate mission to wipe out the mutants. During the battle on a small abandoned island of Geonosha, the heroes make a last attempt to overcome the Red Onslaught. Scarlet Witch and Doctor Doom use an inversion spell to alter Red Onslaught's consciousness. After casting the spell, they were successful, however, the Avengers that were fighting on the island gained the side effects of the inversion spell rendering an alter conscious of the heroes like Tony Stark. Shortly after the battle, we fast forward to Tony Stark, and he creates a free downloadable app called Extremis. For some of you hardcore Marvel fans, you know that the Extremis virus was the main plot in Iron Man 3. Extremis was a super soldier project developed by a biotech company called Future Farm, which was a secondary company of Stark Industries in the comics. The project was funded by the US military, but then shortly abandoned. After Tony Stark releases the downloadable app for free, people are given the option to download the virus into their body making them appear perfect. At Tony Stark's new headquarters in San Francisco, he is confronted by Matt Murdock, Daredevil, and the two clash. This is where we first see Tony Stark using the Iron Man superior suit. As the two fight in a hand-to-hand -hand combat, Tony Stark is able to easily beat Daredevil and toss him out of his building with ease. It's actually a pretty funny moment in the comic. Things stop being so funny once Tony Stark and Sam Wilson, Captain America, try preventing Steve Rogers to revert the heroes back to their normal self after the inversion spell Scarlet Witch and Doctor Doom used to stop Red Skull Onslaught. So how is it possible they could bring Iron Man Superior into the MCU? We all know Tony Stark is no longer part of the MCU timeline, but in the upcoming movie Avengers Secret Wars, we can only speculate they can take some source material from the comics and they can bring back Iron Man for the fight from another timeline. That's not to say though, it would be the actor Robert Downey Jr. What if they use someone like Tom Cruise to play Tony Stark? We all remember when we thought we'd see Iron Man Superior in Doctor Strange Multiverse of Madness. I remember the rumors being very hot on that topic, but as normal, it just turned out to be rumors. Let me know in the comments below, do you think they're going to bring back Iron Man? Would it be Robert Downey Jr. or another actor? I know the return of Robert Downey Jr. has been shot down by Marvel executive, I'm going to butcher his name, Steven Brassard, stating that Iron Man will no longer be part of the MCU storylines. But I would say that too if I wanted to make the fandom blow their eyeballs out of their socket in a super secret elaborate script to bring him back. But these are all speculations. Make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. As always, stay heroic.